Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Kush. In today's video, I'm going to share some Navratri essentials for jewelry. So there would be some must-haves that you should have in your home. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and like and share this video. Now let's get started. So some of the very important things about Navratri jewelry is all the silver and gold pieces. So you should at least have one to two such huge statement necklaces which you can wear it on your Navratri days and even otherwise as a boho chic uh, necklaces. I'm going to show you some of those that I have. Uh, first up is this one. This is a Chantmali layered necklace. So you should have something like this in your wardrobe. Uh, you can check out my jewelry haul where I showed you all of If you want to see that, kindly check somewhere here on the screen. I would link it here. Another um, silver jewel you must have is something like this which has a little bit of rhinestone and coin necklace. Now this one is very, very in trend and you can wear this with your western outfit as well. But in Navratri, this is a must. So the first must have is some silver jewelry. The second must have is gold jewelry. So as we saw that silver is the theme for Navratri, but a lot of dresses have golden work. So silver does not go with it. So you should also have some uh, statement golden necklaces in your wardrobe that would look really good. So for example, I have this beautiful choker kind of a necklace and it's also a coin necklace. So it, it covers your whole neck and it, it looks so good. I have also worn it with a western off shoulder top and it looks gold. Something more blingy like this. Also you can have this. You can also use as your mathapati, your bajuban. So if you have something like this, um, in gold, it goes a long way. So, in must have are some gold pieces. The third must have is pom pom. So, as you know, that pom poms have been in, in trend for the last year already, and you see them everywhere in dresses, in tops, in kurtas, in kolapuri, everywhere you see pom poms. So, they are also a must have in jewelry because they look very colorful and they go well with any kind of outfit. So I have this very chunky piece in silver. It has loads of colors. So I can mix and match this very easily. Finally, uh, you can also go for some nice uh, pom pom which doesn't have silver, but they look really nice with your all Indian wear. So the third essential is pom pom jewelry. Fourth essential is this um, offbeat kind of a gold color which has black in it. So this one is uh, this one is trending a lot nowadays because it's not your body gold but it's a very subtle coppery gold and this one suits a lot of Navratri outfits as well as western outfits. I have another piece similar to this dull uh, opera. So this is a choker that I got from West Side. Go check out uh, my West Side haul as well. I would link that also somewhere here and find out how much I bought this for. So uh, as I was saying this is again a beautiful choker and goes very well with the ethnic as well as western wear. The fifth must have is something which has a lot of colors. So if you do not like pom 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 or you feel that you want to have something else that goes well with all the colors, you can invest something which has loads of different colors. So uh, this one you can pair up with any chaniya or blouse as it has uh, it is multicolored. Also get something like this which goes well as a majuband or even as a kara since it's colored. have some multi angles as well so you can pair up the look really nicely. So the sixth must have is uh, kundan jewelry. So as we know kundan we wear on a lot of ethnic functions but they go really well with Navratri because they have gold and they have beautiful red green stones which go with a lot of our uh, Navratri outfits as well. So something like these uh, goes really well. You can mix and match with golden and uh, kundan earrings something like this that have pearl work or kundan work goes really nicely as well. Last but not the least are some tiny tidbits that you need to have at least one pair. So for example, this is a huge uh, silver kada that I have and something like these can you know instantly jazz up the whole outfit when playing or doing things. So this is something that you need to have. Similarly, get a copperish gold, not a very gaudy one. Get something like this. This also looks beautiful when you wear 
gold bangles, some silver bangles. So these are some tidbits that you need to have in your wardrobe regardless of whatever style. Flaunt all these beautiful pieces on you and play all night and make a statement. Until next time, bye bye.